Hey guys, what's going on? It's uh, Lunar Tadpole, and I am bringing you a brand new unboxing of the Galaxy S4 case. Um, it's a life-proof case, and it just came out. Um, I don't really know. I'm, I've been seeing it on the shelves until about two weeks ago, and I just broke down and finally bought it. But uh, my my previous case didn't come with everything, and I used it for about a week, and I loved it. And then I had to take it back because there was like some sort of complication with the case, it wasn't sealing all the way. And they gave me a replacement, and so I'm going to be doing an unboxing for you guys. Um, so far, just looking at the box, I mean, it's a, it's a good looking box, which I really like about products because it shows that the, that the company has like put a lot of work into it. I mean, has everything listed on the bottom here, like uh, shock proof, snow proof, dirt proof, waterproof, all that. Um, even on the back, it lists everything, like, sealed from all of it, submersible to, what, 6.6 .6 feet. Uh, even says on the bottom here, it's, like, military-grade shockproof, um, water test guarantee, maximum water and dust protection, all that. And then even, like, flipping into the inside and, like, seeing the case, and it kind of has, like, this preview page. And it even lists all this stuff, like, thinnest case ever made and it's actually remarkably thin for being life proof um, basically lists off all the stuff it does and the camera lens is actually unbelievable for being uh, waterproof and everything and well here we'll jump right into right into the unboxing right now okay well to start it off we have um have the case it's good looking I kind of went over that already okay uh, Seal's broken. Okay. Let's open this puppy up. Okay, well, right away out of the box, it comes out like two pieces right away. Because when, the first time you seal it, that's supposed to be like the only time you seal it. And so, we've got the main two pieces. And this cord, I mean, it's as you can see, it's not the screw on piece that, that the Life Proof has like on the iPhone. It's just a simple plug it in and it's protected by these o-rings and I mean it's a it's a pretty hard cord to like really get into the phone and take it out but it's definitely water sealable and then uh, we also have like the little I don't know screen screen cloth um, instructions and all this and what it tells us basically how to put it on and everything check check all the seals um, nothing really Nothing really too exciting there. Yeah, it, yeah, it gives the instructions right there. Um, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's a pretty, it's a pretty self-explanatory case. Um, oh, sorry about that. Just got the sniffles. Um, I, I, re I really wish that they like the the headphone jack. I, I mean, it's nice that it's just a straight up plug in. I mean, look at this. It's just like a little, it's just a little like plug that they put in, which I mean. I, tr I trust it. I trust it enough. Like, I've fully sub submerged my phone, like, in a hot tub completely, and it works. But it's just, I mean, if you're using your phone underwater, I mean, how easy is it just to just to accidentally clip that off? And I don't know. I, I would rather have it the screw that, like, the iPhones have. But, I mean, ah, what can you do? Okay, let's unwrap this quick. There we go. So that we can clean off the screens. Okay. Yeah, and this is my S4. Um, has quite a bit of dings and scratches on it. Uh, like, got some up here. I don't know. It's just not in the best shape. Oh, and another thing about my S4, the glass is gone. I uh, I shattered my glass a while ago, and well, it didn't take any pictures. So I thought, I'm like, oh, okay. Well, if it's not going to take any pictures the way it's supposed to, then well, let's try to figure something out. And I and I just straight up like took the glass out piece by piece. And it, it I mean, it doesn't take the best pictures as, as it did before because the glass really helped out the clarity. But it's better than having no camera at all in that back plate. And that's and this phone has one of the most unbelievable cameras that I've ever even used. Like it takes unbelievable pictures. Okay, I just kind of. Clearing off the back of this. Uh, come on. Getting all 
this white stuff off. It's left under in packaging, I believe. I don't know. There we go. Okay. I mean, it's a pretty easy case to put on. I really got to do just kind of just snap it in find a find a spot there we go yeah one thing about putting the case on make sure you that that you got like both of these covers like out and not in because that uh, it can snap it and well you don't want to do that but yeah I mean it's that easy like you got the port right here on top. Not the not the best supporting port, but I don't know. Um, yeah, pretty pretty nice case. You got this one down here. That works out pretty well. Um, buttons buttons are actually really responsive, and they can, they have a clicky feeling to them, which I like. I don't I don't like having that soft that soft kind of feeling, but they do have a click to them, which I do like. Um, touch screen obviously just works fantastic um, great great overall case and even even with the jack right here the jack um, I mean not a screw on or anything it just just gotta give it a little force and it just pops right in and it's it's fully sealable I've had I've had my phone with this with this on playing music in my hot tub and it it works completely I mean it's it's nice and everything but I would I would much rather have the screw on one is I mean you can trust it a little more basically um, even with this I mean it's it's still pretty nice and it seals out all the water but I would just still have rather have the screw on from what I feel and yeah this isn't the only life proof that they have for the Galaxy S4 they do have the nude case which actually does not have this uh, plastic like filament kind of like plastic casing over the screen it's a um, it's just completely like nude basically that's why they call it the nude case and it just has a water seal edge going around the outside that they have and it just seals around the screen so that you can still use the actual screen and still have the clarity of the actual screen but it's I mean I looked at that and it's like ten dollars more and this one's eighty and that one's about ninety. And I just thought and I'm like I mean you accidentally bump it, bump the edge maybe or something and water could seep in and I don't know. I just didn't trust that one. I just went with this one. Then this one's this one's really nice. Um it re really responsive buttons, screen's great and and a lot of the sensors still work. Um the the one sensor I still have not like it doesn't work too well is the like Hover your hand over um, the air gesture where it brings up the preview screen. That one doesn't work too well with the case on, but other than that, even like even like the message previews, um, that everything else still works with it. Um, ca whoops, uh, ca cameras are pretty good. Um, outside camera, I mean, mine isn't that clear, but outside camera works pretty good. Even this camera right here, really. I mean, it shows it pretty good. Um, but other than that, I mean, it's a great case. I love it. Um, this is just another unboxing that I had from my previous one that I had to return and just got a brand new one about an hour ago. So just did an unboxing on it. But anyways, uh, th thanks for watching, guys. Uh, check out my other videos, and, well, we'll see you around.